everyone. Today's video is just a quick drugstore haul. I just went shopping a little bit yesterday and I wanted to share with you some of the fun stuff that I came across. Um, so let's get started. Uh, the first thing that I picked up yesterday was this and I already have one of these but my daughter actually got into it and ruined it. So I had to go get another one which was my excuse to go into the makeup aisle. And so the first thing that I want to show you is the Maybelline New York Dream Bouncy Blush. And this is what it looks like. The color that I have is Pink Frosting. Um, it's a really pretty color. Uh, I haven't got to wear it yet. I just got it yesterday. And as you can see, I don't have any makeup on today because I was kind of running late this morning. I didn't get a lot of sleep. So I just kind of didn't do any makeup. So this is the color. Um, and what's so cool about these blushes is they've been all over YouTube and I just decided to try them recently. I'm absolutely in love with them. Um, as you can see, is they're just very soft. Um, the colors are very nice, very great for spring. I've been really getting excited about the spring colors that are coming out. Because um, it kind of gives you the feeling of like a uh, like a cream blush or like a stick blush. It gives you that nice, soft. Um, the other one that I had before was this one. This is the Peach Satin. And this is a really pretty color too. I figured I'd just get a different color since I had to replace this one. I didn't want to just get the same color because I wanted to try other ones. Um, this is ruined, obviously. But that's what this looks like. Um, I can probably still use it, I guess, but it's just she got into it and um, you know how that goes. So it really doesn't show up that great on my finger. You're not going to be able to see it, um, which I originally thought it wasn't going to be very um, be very bright on my face, but you don't need a lot of this stuff. As soon as you put it on, it just really gives you a lot of color payoff. And I don't think they were very expensive. I think these were like six or seven dollars. So I really liked that. Um, the next thing that I came across. I've heard a lot about these two on YouTube and I've been really wanting to try them but I was kind of skeptical because I don't really like their products too much usually and I also um, I get kind of I don't know leery of sheer like lip colors. They don't usually give me as, enough color or tint so I didn't want to try it but I decided to get one. Um, this is the Color Burst Lip Butter by Revlon and the packaging is just too cute to pass up really. Um, the color that I have is Strawberry Shortcake, and these actually are really cute. Um, and then this is just what it looks like. It just kind of looks almost like a, like a balm, but it actually does give you a lot of color. I know you probably can't see that, but it's very glossy. It's, it's actually more pigmented than I thought it was going to be, and um, very moisturizing. I really like this. They didn't have a whole lot of colors at our store. They were sold out of most of them, so I didn't have a huge selection to choose from. So most of the good colors were gone. Uh, there were some purples left, but I don't really wear purple lipstick. So I got this one. I will try some more because I really do like this. And I would definitely suggest trying it because it's very moisturizing. I hate when my lips get really dry and chapped and just crispy when I'm wearing a lipstick because that's not sexy. So this is really nice. I really like that. Um, another lip thing that I ended up with is the Hard Candy Plumping Serum Volumizing Lip Gloss. And the color that I got was Girl Next Door 150. Um, I really like these. I've used this before. The other one that I had is like the writing's like all gone on it. And this was Uptown Girl. Um, and this, they're really shimmery. I don't know if I can open this. This one's almost gone, as you can see. But it's just, it's got the, um, the sponge tip applicator, which a lot of people don't like. I actually prefer it because I find that it gives me a much more precise application. I like to do it just in the center of my lip and I don't like it all over and I find that the brush kind of makes it sloppy and I don't like that. So I got another one of these because I was out of that one. And this color is a little bit of a lighter, um, like a softer pink color. And this is so beautiful. I just love these. Um, you probably can't see that too well, but it's just a nice shimmery um, lip gloss. And it really does make your lips 
plump up some. I've found when I wear it, I really feel like, what I usually do is I just wear it over a lipstick. And since they're kind of sheer, you can almost do any lip color with it. Just kind of put a little bit over it just to give you just an extra like, you know, um, little extra plump in the middle. So these are really great. Um, a lot of their products I've been kind of disappointed in, but I really do like this. Also, another thing that I got is the, this is by Rimmel. This is the Exaggerate Full Color Lip Liner. And the color that I got was Addiction. And it was number 018. And this is just kind of a nude color. The actual color they had, I think it was called Natural, they were out of. Because I, I have a hard time finding nude lip liners. I wouldn't try to order some from BH Cosmetics, but when I did, they were out of most of their colors. So I got a few, but I didn't get any like nude, you know, or neutral colors. And this is interesting because the tip of this is kind of tapered, which I'm not used to seeing with a lip liner. So um, it's, it's pretty nice though. It's a nice color for, you know, a neutral, kind of just gives you like a tan, um, you know, natural color. I haven't got to wear this one yet either. So I've been wearing my lip butters today that I really enjoy that. I've been wearing that all day. I don't have it on right now because I just got home from work. So also I got from Revlon, I got a color stay eyeliner. And the color that I got was cocoa. I also got this and I haven't opened this yet as you're going to be able to see. This is the ultra brow brush on color by Maybelline. And the color I got was dark brown. And that's what that looks like. And it just comes with, you probably can't see, but there's just a little brush in there. Just a little, like, tapered um, angle brush. And I just got this because I, I like sometimes to use, um, I did, like I said, I didn't have a lot of time today, so I just kind of used the liner and just filled in my brows a little bit. But I like to do this when I want a more, just a softer eyebrow look. And sometimes I just use eyeshadow, but I figured I would get this to see if this maybe gave me a better application. So like I said, I haven't opened it, but it looks like, hopefully it's pretty pigmented um, and it will give me a good, good color. So that's nice. Um, I think this is the last thing that I got. I'm wearing this on my nails right now. This is the Hard Candy Just Nails nail color. And the color that I have is Sky. So you can see um, this is the color. And what's really cute about this is that it comes with this little part on the bottle when you get it. And it's just a little ring. And it looks, it probably seems cheesy to everybody, but I just think it looks so cute. You know, you just kind of like have this little plastic ring and you can match your nails to it. And I just think it's adorable. I have another one in a different color, but I can't find the ring to it. So I'm kind of bummed about that. I had to put about three coats of this on to get a full, even color. It's a really pretty blue, like shimmery uh, color. I really liked it. I thought it turned out very pretty. It's a very spring color, and I'm kind of getting excited, obviously, about spring and the colors that are coming out. So I've been kind of going a little bit nuts with, you know, buying spring colors. But I really liked this. I thought it was really pretty. They had a couple other colors. They have a lot of yellows out now, and I really wanted to get one, but... I only wanted to get one uh, nail polish, so I went with this one, and it's really pretty. So that's it for my haul video, and I hope you liked it, and I will see you guys soon.